you got this! I'm Shinjiro Wada. My wife was right in the middle of giving birth. Sir, we need to perform a C-section. We have no other choice. But the mother, there's a chance you might not make it. What? Can't you do something to save both of them? I'll try my best, but the odds aren't good. Uh, please, save my baby. Please. Yes, ma'am. Come on, get her to the operating room, now! Oh no... Then, my first daughter, Akiho, was born. But unfortunately, this was supposed to be the happiest day of my life. I can't believe she's gone. My wife didn't make it. I'm Akiho. I'm in first grade. And I don't have a mom. The other day, my mom took me to this really nice cafe. I went to Maristar Land with mom last week. Sounds fun. I'm jealous. What about you, Akiho? Don't you ever hang out with your mom? Shush! She doesn't have a mom, remember? Oh, right! I'm sorry. It's okay. I've always felt a little insecure about this. Ever since I was a little kid. I'm home. Hey, I made you some cheeseburgers. Your favorite, right? Dad... He was trying his best to look after me, but I still wish I had a mom. I was now in middle school. Today, we're gonna read our essays about our family's occupation. Okay, Akio, you're up. Okay, my dad works at a local factory. He makes small parts for a manufacturing company. She must be poor. <laughs> huh? Why are they laughing at me? What's wrong with working in a factory? Hey, stop it guys! Everyone plays a role. Stop being rude. The teacher told them to stop, but... The whole thing just changed the way I looked at my dad. Okay, next, Jinguji! My father is the CEO of a large global company. He's got thousands of employees, so he's always busy with meetings and stuff. His father was nothing like mine. As expected of Jinguji, his father is so amazing! Of course my father's a loser. Nothing about him is amazing. <sighs> you know what? I don't need him. Screw him. I don't want to deal with him anymore. Yesterday I broke up with the captain of the soccer team. What? Why? Yeah, didn't you say he's the one? Well, all he cares about is soccer, so I just got bored with him. So, who are you gonna go with next? Well, I kinda have my eyes on this new guy. <laughs> really? <laughs> that was fast. <laughs> I was now in high school. I was your typical teenager. Hey, Sarah, can I talk to you for a minute? Sure, what is it? I really like your mask and, well, I wanted to know where I can buy one. Wow, you're the first one that's ever said that to me. This is from Moroboshi Pharmaceuticals. It's the Ultra Cut Premium Mask. It's made out of 100% cotton and... That's Kojiro Sara, my classmate. He was a bit strange, but I heard his family was rich and apparently he was pretty handsome without those glasses and the mask on. Oh, I see. You know, you're so interesting and I really want to know more about you. So, what are your plans this weekend? Would you like to go on a date with me? What? Seriously? A, a date? I'd love that! That weekend, we went on a date and we talked about our future. First, I'm gonna get into S University. Then, I'm gonna become a professional investor. I also want to be an engineer. That's so awesome! When I grow up, I want to start a family of my own. Oh, sounds great! Tell me more! Oh yeah, it's working! <laughs> it's working! <laughs> but my dad, he works at a small factory and it's kind of embarrassing, so... First, I want to get a job and get out of the house. After that, I'm going to cut all ties with him. Now he's going to think I'm an independent woman, but then... <sighs> Sorry, but if you can't respect your loved ones, I can't be friends with you. I gotta go. 
What? Hey, where are you going? I can't believe Akiho is starting college already. <laughs> Time flies. I think I made way too much food though. <laughs> it was Akiho's first day at college, so I got off work early and cooked her a nice dinner to celebrate. So I waited for her to come home, but she was running late. Oh, look at the time. Is she okay? I texted her and asked her where she was. She opened the message, but she didn't reply. Hmm, maybe she's with her new friends. Oh well, I guess I'll just celebrate on my own. Congratulations, Akiho. After that, she started spending the night at her friend's house more often. She came back every now and then, but... Uh, Akiho, what are you wearing? You should wear a jacket or something. Ugh, leave me alone. I can wear whatever I want. I'm a grown-up now. And I want to marry a winner. And I don't want to end up with a loser like you, okay? I'm going to find a rich guy in college and get him to marry me, so I need to look my best. Uh, Akiho... A few months later, I met someone. Takao, sorry I'm late. Did you wait long? No worries, I just got here. So where are we going today? I found this nice cafe on Instagram. Oh, that sounds great. I met Mr. Takao through a dating app, and he worked for a big manufacturing company that made smartphones, and he was such a wonderful person. I think that he's actually the one for me. And then, about a year later... I need you in my life, Akiho. Please marry me! I'd love to. Yes, I will. He proposed to me while I was still in college. Needless to say, of course I said yes. And things moved pretty quickly after that. So, uh, a wedding is coming up. I'd like to meet your father, if that's okay. Oh, you're still going on about that? I told you, he's a loser, okay? There's no need to talk to him. I'm not inviting him to the wedding and that's final. It's family stuff, so I probably shouldn't say anything. Well, if you say so, Akiho. Are you sure, though? Yes, I'm sure. I hate my dad. He makes me sick. One day, Akiho came and talked to me. I couldn't remember the last time we talked. I need to tell you something. Huh, this is a nice surprise. What's up? I'm getting married. What? Really? I wasn't expecting that, but I was really excited to hear the good news. Oh, this is wonderful. I can't wait to see you in a wedding dress. Hold on, I'm not inviting you, okay? <laughs> you really think I'd want you at my wedding? What? Why? You're a loser! You've embarrassed me countless of times. And after I get married, I'm going to cut off all ties with you, so... What? Well, gotta go. Bye. Then, she left the house. Akiho. I thought she was just going through her rebellious phase. I thought things would go back to normal if I just gave her some time, but... Now, it was too late. I should have talked to her more. But now, it's too late. I was really upset, so I decided to take some time off and travel. I just wanted to take my mind off of things. <laughs> Give me another one! On the rocks! Are you alright there? <laughs> Not really. You want a drink with me? Whoever you are? Sure, why not? I was drinking at this hotel and I ran into this guy at the bar. <laughs> After the wedding, I'm going to hand in my marriage application right away. Then I'm going to cut all ties with my father forever. Looks like she's having a good time. Akiho was enjoying herself at the wedding. Then I took a look at the guest list. Maybe her father showed up at the last minute. I really want to see him. I've never met him once. But unfortunately, he wasn't here. He's her father. I still think she should have invited him. Wait a minute. I recognize this name. Wait. No way. This can't be. Maybe it's not him. It's a pretty common name, so... Hey, Akiho. Why didn't you want to invite your father again? I told you already, he's a loser. Why do you feel that way? Can you uh, tell me more about him? 
He's nothing special. He just works at this little factory and he's a loser, okay? He just embarrasses me. That's it. That's all you need to know. A small factory? It's him for sure. Traveling abroad helped me relax a bit. But then I got this call. Uh, hello? Hello? It's Takao Ishikawa from Money Money Mobile. Is this a good time to talk? It was from this salesman from a company I did business with. Uh, sure. Uh, what's up? Um, I'm getting married today and I think I'm marrying your daughter. What? I knew she was getting married, but I had no idea it was you. I just found out. I'm so sorry about her. I know how rude she's been to you. Will you come to our wedding? It's not too late. Um, I'm not in the country right now, so I can't. Oh, okay. I hung up the phone and went back to talk to Akio. She had no idea who her father was. What's wrong with you? Why are you being so rude to your father? What? What's your problem? You don't even know him! He's a loser, okay? This is family stuff anyway, so stay out of it! Your father has done a lot for me! I know him very well! What? What do you mean? Akio's father owned a small factory in town. Hello, sir. Thank you for the last shipment. We wouldn't know what to do without your parts. Good to hear. He wasn't a big company, but we couldn't make our phones without his parts, and his company had more than 50% of the market share. I've been doing business with him for many years now. He's been really good to me. He's liked by everyone. I respect him very much. Wait, hold on. My dad's a CEO? Meanwhile, our guests were waiting. Is everything okay? Maybe the bride ran away. Oh, you stop it. And then, the lights went off. What's going on? Someone must have hacked our system! This is so messed up. You raised her single-handedly. You deserve to be at the wedding. Here, let's crash the party. So the guy I met at the bar, he was with a friend named Sera, and when he heard about what happened, he hacked the system at the wedding hall. I didn't even know you could do that. Piece of cake! What's happening right now? I have no idea. Akiho, congratulations. Oh no, it's my dad. He's trying to get back at me. He must be so angry. My life is over, I'm done for. And he's probably gonna embarrass me in front of all of my guests. I didn't even know what to think anymore. You probably don't remember anything, but I still remember the day you were born like it was yesterday. You were my first child, so I did my best to take care of you, but I was always busy with work, and for that, I'm sorry. And when you were going through your rebellious face, I didn't know what to do. I just didn't know how to talk to you, but I should have tried harder. What? I wish I had spent more time with you, Akio. I'm sorry. But I'm very happy for you. So, congratulations. I sent you a little something, so... Hope you enjoy it. Well, I better leave you guys to it. Have a wonderful wedding. What the... <sighs> Shinjiro-san. I wasn't expecting that. Um, excuse me, this is for you. The staff then brought me a box, and it was filled with cash. There was over 100k inside of it. Oh, Dad, I'm so sorry. I was such a horrible daughter to you. I thank you so much for taking care of me all by yourself. I'm so sorry. I knew nothing about my dad. Ever since I was a kid, every time something didn't go my way, I blamed my father. I felt like such an idiot. I should have known. Akiho, I'm sure he'll understand. We'll go talk to him together, okay? <laughs> okay. Everyone started clapping after the video ended. 
Dad, I'm so, so sorry about how I treated you all of these years. It wasn't right, and I hope you can forgive me. I'm sorry too, Akiho. I should have taken more time to talk to you. Bring it here. Daddy... Mom, it's Akio. I'm so sorry for making you worry. You gave your life to me, and I put all of that blame on Dad, but you don't have to worry anymore. I'm going to make things right from now on, I promise. Sir, it's so good to finally meet you as your son-in-law. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm glad my daughter married you. I'm sure my wife feels the same way. Hello, Jingaji? Hey! How did it go? Great. I think everything's gonna be okay, thanks to you guys. Glad to hear. Let me know if you need anything else. What a kind-hearted guy. After all the horrible things she said to him. Well, he's her father, so I guess his love for her is unconditional. Make sure to thank your parents, everyone. Don't forget to subscribe. Looking for more interesting stories and videos? Then come check out other videos from Mani Mani people here. We'd love to hear your thoughts too. Drop a line in the comments below. See you soon.